Hi, my name is Stevan. In this video I will show you how you can map motion controls of your MIDI Fighter 3D to Ableton Live. So first thing we want to make sure that Ableton is picking signals from MIDI Fighter. So we want to go into preferences and then under MIDI tab here make sure that input and output of your MIDI Fighter 3D is enabled just like here. Once you set remote and track, close the preferences. As you can see, we will be working with frequency shifter here. We are going to map some parameters. Now we are ready to enable MIDI Learn mode. Click on command you want to map, or I mean control, and tilt your MIDI fighter. Now here is the trick. Before you uh, put it back to the zero, you want to disable this middle on button. So now CC is 5, that's the CC for for forward tilt on the MIDI fighter. And while the CC is 5, make sure to disable this MIDI button. And now you can see that drive edge is fully working. Let's go into MIDI mode again. And now pick maybe amount and do the same. Tilt, new command will appear. Make sure that both, both are set to CC5 and disable. And now we have macro control. Let's do something for the side tilt as well. Again, MIDI mode. And maybe let's do frequency now. Click on the frequency and tilt your MIDI fighter to the right. You will see that we, will, we have CC6 here. So while the 6 is there, disable MIDI. That's it. Now I will show you one more trick. Uh, as you can see now, we don't we maybe don't want control like this. Maybe we want uh, to center to be your start position. This is how you do it. So we will click on the frequency here and make sure that this minimum value this minimum value is our start value. We, we can click on it and drag it up and down to set the start value. As uh, <clears throat> Since we want the center to be a start value, we will set zero here. And just leave like this. So now if we tilt the MIDI fighter, you will notice that the value is going directly to zero and then as you tilt it all to the right you have full motion. Let's go into MIDI mode again and maybe do fine adjust now. Tilt it to the left until the CC4 is there. And now we will do the opposite. So click on the fine. Again, set zero as your start value. And now do the opposite. Let's do minus for this side. Now disable MIDI. And let's see. that's working of course you can combine motion let's play this truck